open up Microsoft Access and click Blank Desktop Database. You can name the file whatever you want and then click Create. Once that's loaded, go and click the button Create at the top and then click Blank Form. Once you're there, go and click Design View in the upper left corner and look for this black rectangle which you will click and it will open the property sheet on the right. Here, you change a few things. Just copy what I put. Just make sure everything I'm changing goes to either none, no, or neither. This is just to edit the form. And it's not entirely necessary. This just makes it easier. Especially for the kind of button. So at the top of the form, you'll see this design. And then click this XXX button. And then you just draw the button size you want and where you want and you can always change it later. So today we want to make a close button so we go to form operations and close form. And in this page you can choose the kind of button you want so it can be that one or that one or you can add your own. Then you click the next button and here you just rename the button so it'll be easier for you to find later on. I'm gonna name it close button. Press finish and you're done. You can resize the button again or move it wherever you want, like in the upper right corner. And you can go back to form view and save the button. Control save, rename it. And it should work. So press it and there, everything closed. And that's how to insert command buttons in Microsoft Access 2013. Go.